Alright right, guys, here is the new toe slash show pig. 2007 5.9 G56 manual. Can bang gears and pass quick. Bone stock truck under the motor. It uh, has a Smarty on it, but we'll probably end up just getting uh, some EFI Live with the toe tune. Get that <laughs> shoes out of here. We're currently on a six inch lift. Some pizza cutters, if anyone needs some 35, 35, 11, 50, 20s with some motive off-roads. I might need some. Hit me up, those will be for sale. Come on up over here to the New York size Meg apartment. Oh, we got drop down Does steps. Step. Mega cab, so if any of you guys are in New York, I have more square footage in my cab than you guys do. Look at all that so, leg room in there. If any of you guys need to rent from me, $5,000 a month upgrade from your New York sized apartment. Does have a sound system, two 12 inch subs behind the back seat. Dang. Um, touch screen, manual, cause it's got a man's mission in it. Fender flare marks, obviously, from the previous owners. Does have a tonneau cover. It's a plus. Um, drop pitch. We'll probably just end up flipping this upside down. Tow the gooseneck on it. It'll just be pointing up like this. We'll oh yeah, that's a good idea. The gooseneck. Don't even need to hit you in the back. We'll just go up even bigger and lift size. Does have a four inch exhaust. This side of the bed is gonzo. Uh, there's like a patch panel in behind this side of the bed. And this is all Bondo. You probably won't see it because it'll be too dark. Um, all Bondo on this side. So if any of you guys have a bed for a 2003 to 2007 Dodge, preferably silver, preferably close to Utah, let your boy know. It must we'll have dropped snag something. It from you. you think they dropped something on it? Yeah, probably. All right. Little Emmanuel. Uh, got a custom size matters because when you have a truck that's this lifted in the air and you have a little little. Wing. Is it the size of the shifter? The size of the motor? It's the size of your shaft. The your size of your shaft. Got it's it. The size of your shaft. Size matters. Obviously, you lift a truck compensating for compensating for a shrimp gain. Got us an AFE power. Intake, air Ooh. fuel equivalent. Who knows? Impressive. Bone stock manifold, stock whole set on it. Um, literally nothing's done to this bone stock. No blow by. Really solid, solid unit to turn into a tow slash show pig. Only the first gen. So um, I'm probably gonna try to buy. The goal is to turn this into a show truck. For those of you who don't know. Before my YouTube days, I built some show trucks, show trucks, I guess. I'll throw some pictures up so you can see. But the goal is to try to buy anything and everything used that I can to keep down on cost, obviously. The only things I'm planning on buying brand new are headlights, because I'm gonna get some Alpha Rex's, B&W hitch, gooseneck hitch. Well, there was a third thing I told you before you came over here. <laughs> <laughs> I can't remember five minutes ago, dude. Headlights and hitch, there's a third thing I just can't remember it right now off the top of my head. Got so it. You'll see another video of us going, traveling to get truck parts. That'll be coming out Wednesday. Let's just try and travel and get everything used I can. I'm gonna get some stock coils used, obviously, and get this back down to stock height. Pull the blocks out of the rear, probably reverse level it. Oh, and airbags. Airbags I'd probably buy new ones, unless I can find Air them. ride suspension. But, We'll get her lowered back down and get it more of a tow pig for the first gen. And I want to dabble in some more show truck stuff as I've been out of the game for like three years and I really miss it. So this is going to be the plan. If anyone has a bed, let me know. If anyone wants these wheels and tires, let me know. Six inch lift is going to go if anyone wants that. Um, mirrors are going to go. Grill's going to go. This SLT bumper is going to go. Dang, freaking parting it out or what? Yeah. Just get at me for your parts. <laughs> I got you. We'll try to keep costs down and turn this into something that build a show truck on the channel as I haven't had one because it's only been the first yet. So this will be another project for me this winter and also the blue first gen for the old man. Damn noise you coming. I think I just lost them. I think I just suffered some hearing loss. Come on boys, come along for a ride along in the first gen. So as I talked in the dyno video, um, spool up was different and 
I can actually spool it from a stock. So uh, we're gonna go over here. I'm gonna get it, show you guys the spool up on it and also gonna just do a quick little rip. Obviously I wish I could just have you guys in here with me to fill it, but I'll try my best to have you experience it through us here. That's gonna so, be a bumpy ride. We're gonna let her get warmed up. Uh, do a spool up test and probably do, go do a quick rip and that'll be the wrap on this video. Nice and simple. Check this out. We got a little guy to tell us what temp we are. It's inside. I don't like spiders. Cute. That's our indicator. attention to us about uh, 100th video I think we're at like 80 something right now 100th video will be a 100th video special and we'll absolutely burn these tires off so hopefully November time frame we can do a massive burnout in celebration of 100 videos and roast these tires off but we're gonna go get some food take care of your 12 out thank you guys for watching peace does look kind of uh, retarded with the wheels and tires on it. I mean... You have to say Papega, because retarded will get us demonetized. That'll, that'll get us banned on yeah. YouTube. That'll get us a... What do they call that when they... I don't know. A, a mark against you. Yeah.